All right, Manny. Give me the case. Charles, I thought we had a bargain. No, we do. But I thought I'd bring some muscle along just in case. What's the matter, Chuck? Can't afford to hire goons to do this sort of work for you? I'm all the goon I need. Now drop it. You said it, boss. Got a card for me? Here. Welcome to the union, Manny. Meetings first Tuesday of every month, and, uh, don't forget to pay your dues. Don't forget to pay my dues. <laughs> I'm a union man now. I'm not using my union card for anything but getting on that boat. see it. Oh, 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 one of Charlie's rush jobs. Good thing your new captain's far-sighted. Uh, still no room for you on board. No word from Naranja, but he's done this before. But I'm first on the waiting list. As it were, yeah. And don't forget that Gladys has got to bring his own tools. He will. He doesn't go anywhere without a lot of tools. Good, because neither does the limbo. Don't just sit around here collecting barnacles. Right. Could you go over that part again about why I can't board? Uh, still no room for you on board. No word from Naranja, but he's done this before. But I'm first on the waiting list. As it were, yeah. And don't forget that Gladys has got to bring his own tools. He will. He doesn't go anywhere without a lot of tools. Good, because neither does the limbo. Don't just sit around here collecting barnacles. Right. What did you say, little kitty? Don't talk, kitty cat. Just run, baby! You can do it! <laughs> baby! I'm not using my union card for anything but getting on that boat. Oh, if I had only known. Open it up on the straightaways, kitty! That's a good cat! Run! What's that? It's so sad to see them suffering without their leader.
They look busy working up a plan to free Terry. Looks like it hurts. Looks like it hurts. It's a little cabinet. Strong stuff. That ought to kill the pain. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. Nah, he'd see me do it. I got your boy Naranya here. M.I.A. he is. Well, he's sobered up. I send him to Limbo. Yeah, yeah. He'll make it there by morning. Promise. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That is what I told him. Let's see what you got on you. Are you Are kidding me? Semen and Selmo Naranja Ensign third class. I gave class. him the Doesn't idea look like in you'll be first showing place. up to work in the morning. Ah, Tiger now. can't change his stripes. So, you still going? Hey, listen to me. You got to take care of yourself. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Never get me under that thing. Sure. Sure, of course, I understand. Definitely. exactly call that quality time. So, what happened after dinner? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, you're kidding me. Oh, I don't believe it. What about kids? is just crying shame. Hmm? Mm. 
Well, if you didn't tell me, someone else would. I tell you, but I cannot. Someone else is here. Let's just say it is bad. Hey, Velasco! Many. Do you mind? Artist at work here, eh? Yes, yes. Tears were shed. No, no, go, go ahead. Tell me the whole thing. I am listening. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. It's empty. All that this paper says is number 36, the rusty anchor. What is that supposed to mean? Ah, uh, hang on a second. This mean anything to you? You mean beside the song, the poem, and the bar, and the statue by that name? Sure! It is one of my most famous designs. Here, I show you. Let's see. Uh, number 30. Harmin Sedge, Harmin Sketo, Harmin... Ah, 36. Here. Hey, what is this? My friend Lola left that here for me. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, Lola was here, sweet girl, like daughter to me. Tell her Papa Toto says hello. Right. Hey, Velasco! Manny, do you mind artist at work here, eh? Looks like these cats are almost scruff and scruff. Semen Anselmo Naranja Ensign Third Class. Semen Anselmo Naranja Ensign Third Class. I could put them on, but I don't think that would fool Velasco. Has, uh... Naranja checked in yet? No, but Toto Santos called. Said he's passed out at his place. So he's in no shape to sail, right? Manny, he's out cold, but not that cold. I'd better go finish packing. Aye, you do that, son.
It's empty. Only and Hey, should I close this? No. I'm trying to air it out. I'd hate to end up like this. Then take my advice. Buy an ID bracelet and wear it always. Wouldn't match my cufflinks. Are you sure you're looking hard enough? Look, Manuel, these old eyes are tired. I'm doing the best I can, but the average retirement age beachcomber has more sophisticated equipment than I've got here. Would a metal detector help the cause? Hey, just like downtown. You never know what this'll turn up. An engraved ring, a belt buckle with somebody's name on it. <laughs> Who would wear a belt buckle with the... Oh. Velasco, it looks like I've got one of your boys down here in the morgue. A sailor by the name of... Naranja. What? How? Sprouted? But... Ah, oh, this town's going to hell. Sailor can't even take a two-day shore leave without watching his back. Yeah, yeah, I'll come down in the morning. All day long, Manny, I sought through pure sadness. I find evidence, and I piece together stories. But none of my stories end well. They all end here. And the moral of every story is the same. We may have years, we may have hours, but sooner or later, we push up flowers. Looks like Membrillo finally locked up and went home. Hey, the new blimp is already in full operation. Let's just hope they fill it with something non-flammable this time. Sprouted? What's happening to this town? Oh, big city crime, Manny. We're getting more of it every day. I know you probably hate getting it this way, but Naranja's job's yours now. No, Velasco, I don't know if I'm comfortable taking that. You'll take his job because there's no one else I can get on such short notice. And don't forget that Gladys has got to bring his own tools. He will. He doesn't go anywhere without a lot of tools. Good. Because neither does the limbo. Don't just sit around here collecting barnacles. Right. I'd better go finish packing. Aye, you do that, son.
almost there! Yeah! Coming home soon? What did you say, little kitty? Don't talk, kitty cat. Just run, baby! This is it! That's a good cat! I don't think that would shed any light on things. I don't think that would shed any light on things. Go! 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 You can do it! Come on! Baby needs a new pair of glass packs! You're doing it! That's the sugar papa like! This is it! Pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad. Me and this ticket printer, we're gonna make a mint. Where'd old Sourpuss go? Anybody there? I told you, we don't give out the kitty hats till Tuesday! Anybody there? I told you, we don't give out the kitty hats till Tuesday. Here. Oh, another Chowchilla Charlie original. Give me one good reason not to throw you out of here. Because I'll tell Max to fire you. Where did that little happy guy get off to? Hello? Oh, hi! Betting stop, please. Here you go. Hey, this looks different than our usual ticket. Well, that's because it's from uh, last season. All right, just a second. <laughs> there you are. Aha! What? Are you a winner? Big winner. Thanks, pal. Glad I could help. It's Lola's last work. A juicy photo of Nick and Olivia kissing. It's Lola's last work, a juicy photo of Nick and Olivia kissing. Looks like a great night for cat races. I think that guy was up to something, don't you, Doug? Doug? I personally, I think he was nuts! You're doing it!
Hello, Maximino. Why, if it ain't Manny Calavera. Come to see how the big boys play, eh, Manny? From what I can tell, they play with kitties. Kitties, roulette tables, what's the difference? They go round and round all day, and they're both more reliable when they're fixed. Am I right? Look, you gotta cut Gladys off. He has a problem. As long as he's got credit, then he's got no problem. Credit? How did Gladys get credit? He's part owner of your club, ain't he? Half owner, actually. Well, he put the joint up as collateral. So as long as you're in business, he's in business. How's the old cat race, Max? Well, volume's pretty low. Most everybody's out of town. Tell me about it. But I've got some side businesses that help smooth over the rough spots. What kind of side businesses? <laughs> Many. Let's just say our El Mato associates appreciate our out-of-town perspective. You know, you got a pretty nice setup here. You got a good little club yourself, Manny. Not as nice as my girlfriend's, of course. Did you say your girlfriend? Hey, Manny, don't pretend you don't hear the gossip. It's not a secret anymore. Olivia and I are officially an item. Well, I just saw Olivia and Nick kissing. Manny, we all kiss here. We're all one big family, you know? No, I mean kissing, Max. Manny, Olivia and I are in love. Nick Virago's been my trusted counsel for years. You shouldn't even joke around about their character like that. It could make me very angry. I'm not joking. That's enough, Calavera. I mean it. Now, <clears throat> let's talk about something we can agree about. I'm here for Charlie's money. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously. He says you have a lot of it. Oh, I got a lot of it, but none of it says. <laughs> I like the new blimp. Yeah, I decided not to let what happened to the Olivia One get me down. Imagine, you try to impress your girlfriend by building her a beautiful airship, and what happens? It goes and crashes, explodes and burns on your own track. It kills her favorite cat, too. Not the kind of thing that makes the young girl's heart score flutter. I'll tell you that twice. Your new waiter's got quite an attitude, even for a snooty waiter type. Hey, Manny, when you put labels like that on people, it's like you stick people in these little boxes and never let them out. We're all in little boxes back home, Max. Six feet under. Now you're talking like the town corner, Manny. Cut it out. I'm leaving town tonight. That's great, Manuel. No one needs a vacation more than you. Get out of town. Forget about that Meche woman. Well, I'll let you get back to staring out the window. Just can't get enough of my cats. I don't want to interrupt this cat watching. This is gonna get me in trouble. On second thought, I better go. Maximino, king of kittens. That Nick sure gets around. You can do it. Look what I found at the photo finish booth. Looks like Naughty Kitten and Bad Tomcat are neck and neck. What do you want? I want to tell you a sad story of a young man unjustly imprisoned merely for speaking his mind. It's time to shake up the hive! I guess our business is settled. Almost. What? Was that for the photo, girl? No, that was just for being you. I don't have time to get you for Lola, but I'm sure somebody will. You didn't have time to save her either, but don't feel too bad about that, Manny. I hear saving women really isn't your forte. Good afternoon. Today's morning is 57 degrees. Today's water is covered with a layer of saving water.